10 places to visit in Ibiza. Ibiza is a ruggedly beautiful island in the Mediterranean, about 100 miles off the coast of Spain. It's best known as the epicenter of electronic dance music, and most tourists come to dance and enjoy themselves in the warm sunshine. The beaches on Ibiza range from wide, well-manicured carpets of sand to rocky beaches in rugged, unspoiled coves surrounded by cliffs. The environments around these beaches also vary wildly. Some beaches are fronted by developed promenades filled with hotels, restaurants, and cafes, while others only have small beach huts or tringuitos, selling snacks and drinks. Number 10. Playa del Bosa This is Ibiza's longest beach and most commercial in terms of beachfront shops and cafes. It's about 10 minutes from Ibiza town, and the promenade is lined with entertainment venues, restaurants, and shops. During the busy season, Playa del Bosa is crowded and lively, and music is playing non-stop, which is part of the attraction. It's not a place to relax and enjoy a quiet beach. It's more a place to have fun, dance, and watch people. Number 9. Sant Josep de Satalia Noted for its tranquil coves, pleasant fishing towns, and nightlife, it gets its name from the highest point of the island, Sant Josep. With 80 kilometers of coastline, the municipality boasts more beaches and coves than any other in Ibiza. Famous coves with crystal blue seas such as Cala Comte, Cala Basa, and Cala Valdea are bordered by pine woods that go right up to the shoreline. Both of the island's natural reserves, Ses Salines and Calla de Hort, are located here. St. Joseph's history is equally fascinating, with several medieval churches to see, as well as archaeological monuments like the UNESCO World Heritage listed Phoenician settlement of Sa Caleta and defensive towers along the shore. Number 8. Cala Yonga is a town and beach resort in the municipality of Santa Ululia del Rio, in the island of Ibiza, in the Balearic Island beaches, Spain. Cala Yonga's residents work hard to preserve their beach's good condition. During peak times, the beach is cleaned daily to maintain its cleanliness and beauty. The seawater is crystal clear and well kept. At the further end of the beach, there are freshwater showers available for everyone. The beach dips gently down into the sea and beyond, allowing youngsters and non-swimmers to swim in a safe and shallow environment. Due to the abundance of things to do, water sports, stores, activities, and safe shallow water, it is a hotspot for families on vacation. Surrounded by a magnificent pine forest, the 360-degree vista from the sand is a picture lovely, and the calm waters are shallow, clear, and secure, making it a favorite option among Ibiza beaches for families with young children. There are lots of sun lounges, and the coastal hotel restaurants have beverages and snacks on hand. In addition, pine trees give much needed shade for tourists who like to chill in the sand. Number 7. Cala Yenya If you're hoping to find a slightly quieter beach in Ibiza, then Cala Yenya may fit the bill. The beach is just 10 minutes away from San Carlos, and it is on the smaller side. That means smaller crowds as well. Instead of offering walking access to dozens of nightlife venues, Cala Yenya is surrounded by lush green pine trees. Beach volleyball is popular at this beach, and many families gravitate toward the more relaxed atmosphere in the area. If you're around on a Sunday, check out the weekly Kaya Yenya markets just before you head to the beach. Number 6. Santa Elulia del Rio Santa Elulia is Ibiza's third biggest town, popular with locals as well as visitors looking for a peaceful vacation. It offers a variety of activities for its visitors. It is a municipality made up of five parishes, Santa Alaria, Sant Carles de Paralta, Santa Gertrudis de Fratera, Jess, and Puig de Valls. This region overlooks 46 kilometers of shoreline and has a lovely hinterland with farmland valleys and pine-covered hills. Swimming is possible in its pristine coves, beaches with clear seas, and beautiful fishermen's nooks. The town's most visible features is the oceanfront promenade, which runs the length of the vast smoke-free beach and is lined with palm trees, tiny gardens, and a big fountain. Facing the sea, you may walk to the extreme right until you can no longer proceed to Mariner's Beach, where the Balearic Solitary River flows into the sea. Number 5. Hortinax Hortinax is a more family-friendly resort town on the north part of the island. The area has three main beaches, and all are quite beautiful. 
The Portinax beaches are much less visited than the beaches around Ibiza town, so it's not very crowded, even during the busy summer season. The largest beach is called Serenal Gras. Around the rocks is his little brother, Serenal Petit. Both are beautiful, with flat sections of white sandy beach. The third beach is Playa Porto, which is more like a little fisherman's village. It's in a cove surrounded by cliffs. Tourists share the space with fishermen and their boats, and there's a lighthouse there too. Sereno Gras has some small restaurants and cafes, along with beach chair and umbrella rentals. Number 4. Sant Antoni de Portmani is the second largest town in Ibiza, situated on the west coast of the Balearic island of Ibiza, Spain. It is noted for its vibrant nightlife and Sant Antonio's Bay, a large natural port. It is one of the island's most popular tourist destinations and it has grown in popularity over time. It is one of the best sights in Ibiza to watch the sunset, and its shoreline is full of tiny, readily accessible coves and beaches with crystal clear turquoise seas, giving it the ideal location for a pleasant and lovely vacation without leaving the municipality. The gastronomy of this little Ibiza town is diverse, with restaurants serving a variety of international cuisines as well as significant locations for enjoying real Ibiza food. Number 3. S. Vedra a small rocky island off the Spanish island of Ibiza's southwestern coast. Known as the legendary island, it has long been touted as the location of the long-lost city of Atlantis and has been attracting a steady stream of tourists since then. It has quickly become one of Ibiza's must-see attractions, and it truly does steal your breath away. You'll note how magnificently it rises from the water, almost emanating a sense of tranquility and comfort. Ibiza sees over 6 million tourists each year and is a haven for those who enjoy long nights and lazy mornings. S. Vedra is a quiet, uninhabited outcrop that most people are not allowed to step foot on. Those who are fortunate enough to visit S. Vedra in person do so only with a special permission, so the rest of us must find another way to appreciate this otherworldly marvel. Several firms, such as Ibiza Boat Cruises, can bring you near it. Number 2. Es Canar On the Spanish island of Ibiza, Es Canar is one of its beach resort hamlets. The resort is located in Santa Eluria des Rio municipality. Sun loungers, parasols, and padello boats may be rented on the Es Canar beach for you to enjoy the sun and the waters. It is also a great site for water sports like water skiing, padellos, and even boat tours from the harbor that take you through beautiful sceneries. There are other more relaxed areas where you may view the sunset, spectacular views, as well as friendly locals. A decent range of pubs, busy cafes, and restaurants can be found here. After a day at the beach, you may go to the surrounding pubs and restaurants for a drink, dinner, or perhaps spend the night dancing in the clubs. Number 1. Ibiza Town The capital and largest city on the island is a port city with a magnificent view of the Mediterranean. The place definitely has something for everyone. The vibrant nightlife in the charming old town and fashionable Marina Botafoch is famous, with world-class restaurants and a diverse range of pubs. Here, you'll discover a wide range of tiny boutiques, high-end fashion stores, shoe stores, and novelty shops. It draws a diverse international clientele all year and is a fantastic site to catch celebrities in the summer. There are several fantastic art galleries and historical museums, as well as the charming medieval citadel of Dot Villa. From late May to early October, the social life in Ibiza town is alive and well, resurfacing in December when the town transforms into a winter paradise of Christmas markets and unique events. 